please subscribe. Not exclusively is the Acura RDX more affordable than a large number of its similarly prepared rivals, its accessible super handling all-wheel drive makes it one of the best time rides in this genuinely moderate class. The third age Acura RDX established an extremely solid first connection when it appeared in 2018. There was a ton to adore about this little premium SUV, from the sharp, ricochet spec style into its deft all-wheel drive execution. For the 2021 model year, the RDX is to a great extent equivalent to it at any point was, which means there's as yet a ton to adore. The RDX's dashboard is home to a great infotainment suite that is fairly frustrated from the start by its true touchpad interface regulator. Up front you'll locate a 10.2-inch HD double substance fundamental presentation, which utilizes a split-screen interface to grandstand the significant infotainment capacities. Clients explore by swiping and tapping on the little touchpad at the base of the middle stack to make on-screen choices. This true touchpad is like, yet in addition not quite the same as, the one on your PC. It utilizes outright situating, so putting your finger in the lower left or focal point of the screen, for instance, right away chooses things likewise situated on the presentation. This makes it simple to rapidly move around the RDX's menus once you realize where everything is. To one side of the primary touchpad territory is a parchment bar that permits clients to rapidly flip the substance showed on that sidebar. So I'm ready to, for instance, place the as of now playing sound source on the correct third of the showcase close by the discretionary 3D view navigation on the principal show zone. A performing various tasks button over the touchpad permits substance to be traded between the two sheets with a solitary tap, for this situation, keeping the guide obvious in the sidebar while I select another radio broadcast or sound source. There are likewise physical catches for back and home situated close the touchpad and, generally speaking, it's sensibly simple to travel through the interface, when you become acclimated to it. The issue is that the expectation to absorb information can be a lofty one. Acura's true touchpad is an exceptionally little surface, requiring more exact developments to make fine determinations, for example, text passage. This can be particularly precarious for right seat travelers who need to utilize their left hand. For objective passage, possibly adhere to the sensibly great characteristic language voice acknowledgement. Apple CarPlay Network is standard, and Android Auto has at last joined the gathering, as well. Associating with them utilizing the true touchpad isn't exactly as regular as the remainder of the interface, however I'm happy to see the two advances present, bringing a great many applications for sound streaming, route and more to the driver's fingertips. Generally, I favor this framework to the comparative remote touchpad you'll discover in current Lexus vehicles. Lexus Inform utilizes a fiddly cursor dab for choices that is anything but difficult to forget about and requires significantly more exact situating to work. Then, the Acura infotainment programming utilizes enormous, simple to target choice boxes for most components of the interface, making it a lot simpler to utilize and requiring less visual consideration while driving. The RDX's Lodge Tech isn't restricted to the inside stack. In front of the driver is a 7-inch shading multi-day to show tucked between the RDX's two physical checks, here, highlighting a spec explicit red light. The RDX's atmosphere controls are GPS connected, considering the sun's position comparative with the vehicle and its effect on the inside temperature when metering out warming and cooling between its lodge zones. Select the advanced trim and a huge, 10.5-inch head-up show will put significant data directly in the driver's view. The third age RDX comes standard with the automaker's Acura watch setup of driver help innovations. That implies even the base model turns out with forward crash notice with impact relief slowing down help, max throttle versatile journey control that works in go back and forth traffic, and path continuing directing help with street flight moderation. Not actually a functioning security highlight, however all RDX models additionally come norm with Acura's 7 section July LED headlights and LED tail lights, bringing brilliant yet unequivocally pointed light when driving after dull. That is now a strong loadout, yet there are a couple of additional items you can include. Venturing up to the technology bundle, $2,900, includes front and back stopping sensors, vulnerable side checking and back cross traffic alert. The top level advanced bundle moves up to an Encompass C camera framework and adds a washer to the standard back camera. The technology bundle is actually the sweet spot in the Acura RDX arrangement, bringing significant well-being highlights, helpful lodge innovations and incredible locally available route to the RDX's now strong standard rundown of hardware. The advanced bundle kicks the common luxuries to most extreme and lifts exacting solace with its versatile damping suspension and acoustic side glass. The A-Spec bundle lives in the center, 
keeping the entirety of the technology overhauls, however exchanging advanced solace for a sportier appearance. Outback, the A-Spec highlights double fumes outlets, and filling the wheel curves are dull completion, 20-inch composite wheels shot with 255-45R20 all-season tires. The all-seasons are likely the best pointer this is an appearance bundle just, not a genuine game update. There are no changes to the suspension or powertrain that cause the A-Spec perform better than or to feel any more keen than the standard RDX. In any event it looks more keen. The RDX A-Spec highlights gleaming dark outside trim, including an extraordinary back spoiler. The shield-formed front grille has a cool black diamond plan and shading. The internals of the headlamps and taillights are additionally more obscure, adding to the meaner look. Obviously, there are A-Spec identifications spread around the outside and all through the lodge, just as dim headlamp and taillight internals. Inside, you'll discover cowhide cut game seats, mine look fabulous in red, with ultra suede embeds and warmed and ventilated surfaces. More ultra suede can be discovered cutting different pieces around the lodge. Red pronunciation lighting and game pedals total the A-Spec visual redesigns. Alright, the A-Spec isn't any quicker than the standard RDX, Yet the standard mechanical setup isn't so awful. The motor cove is home to a 2.0-liter turbocharged four-chamber motor that tops at 272 drive and 280 pound-feet of force. The force plant is mated to a 10-speed program transmission with an electronic apparatus selector on the middle comfort and or shifters on the guiding wheel. Drivers have a touch of command over the RDX's presentation with an enormous dynamic mode choice handle close to the base of the middle stack. Winding switches between comfort, snow, sport and sport plus modes influences the choke reaction, foothold control and upgrades the motor note for the sportier settings. My sole grumbling is that the selector looks and is situated a great deal like a major, old volume handle. My travelers and I frequently unintentionally pop the SUV into sport mode when attempting to wrench up our main tunes. Front wheel drive is standard, however you'll unquestionably need Acura's 4th age super handling all-wheel drive, SHAWD, redesign. Regularly, I just truly suggest all-wheel drive for territories with heaps of helpless climate, and still, at the end of the day, suitable tires likely biggerly affect well-being, however SHAWD is additionally a presentation update, which makes it valuable and even fun when the streets are dry. It's certainly worth the $2,000 premium. SHAWD can send up to 70% of the motor's accessible force to the back wheels on request, the past age could just deal with a 50-50 split, which helps in power dispersion when propelling from a stop. The framework additionally now includes 100% force vectoring on the back hub to help in cornering steadiness. At the point when you steer into a corner and the vehicle's weight begins to move, SHAWD will effectively send capacity to the back external wheel to help steer into the corner. This new age can rearrange power around 30% snappier, which likewise causes the force move to feel more consistent out and about. Hurling the RDX through a progression of mid-speed S-turns or a quick arrangement of clearing twists, the SUV carries on and feels like an a lot littler vehicle. In any case, there are as yet those troublesome laws of material science to battle with. SHAWD depends on the choke to help in pivot, so it doesn't help much during moderate, off-choke corners, for example, close curves leaving the SUV feeling less powerful the more slow you go. Also, the RDX is a tall SUV with a solace situated suspension, so there's just so much speed that you can bring through a quick turn before SHAWD basically can help. Luckily, the progress between slaloming bravely and challenges, excessively quick is smooth and simple to get. The RDX is a SUV that urges you to push it securely. Get the choke application and directing perfectly and the RDX can be an outright treat on the correct street. Obviously, this isn't a games vehicle, so I'm treating the delight that SHAWD brings under the correct conditions as a little something extra ace, as opposed to its restrictions as con. Around town, the standard McPherson Swagger front and multi-length back suspension is agreeable and responsive, the electric force guiding is quite straight and the 12-inch circle slows down at all four corners are anything but difficult to adjust and work admirably pulling the 4,105-pound SUV to a stop rapidly and typically. With SHAWD, the EPA and Acura gauge the RDX is useful for 23 consolidated miles for every gallon, 21 miles per gallon city and 26 miles per gallon expressway, when utilizing the suggested 91 octane fuel. During my 7-day stretch of testing, spent generally in the slopes investigating sport mode, I just arrived at 19.1 miles per gallon. Front-wheel drive models toll somewhat better at an expected 24 miles per gallon consolidated, 22 city MPG and 28 Parkway MPG. 
The 2021 Acura RDX begins at $39,225 including its $1,025 test cheap.